Cincinnati Reds sign Dominic Smith to one-year deal. Welcome Red Sox fans share and subscribe to the channel and activate the notification to receive the latest news from Boston Red Sox. Help US reach the 2,000 subscribers so that our channel arrives for more people I count on all of you. The Cincinnati Reds confirmed on Thursday, 22, the signing of first baseman Dominic Smith, who recently became a free agent after being released by the Boston Red Sox. Although the financial terms of the deal have not been publicly disclosed, Smith's arrival is seen as a strategic addition to the Reds roster, aiming to strengthen their infield options, especially due to the injuries that have plagued the team. Smith, who is 29 years old and has already accumulated a solid career in Major League Baseball MLB, was released by the Boston Red Sox just two days before signing with the Reds, on Tuesday 20. According to Jeff Passan, a well-known journalist from ESPN, the Red Sox had great appreciation for Smith and his hitting ability. However, with the imminent return of young first baseman Tristan Casas to the lineup, Boston's team opted to release Smith, allowing him to seek a new opportunity with another team in the league. Dominic Smith has been a consistent presence in the major league since his debut, and his presence on the Reds roster adds a layer of experience and reliability that could be crucial for the team, especially at a time when the team needs to deal with several injuries at the first base position. With three players currently on the injured list, Smith's signing comes at a critical time, offering the team an experienced alternative to strengthen the lineup. This season, Smith has put up respectable numbers, with six home runs and 34 RBIs in 83 games played. His ability to excel both defensively and offensively makes him a valuable asset for any team, and the Reds are certainly hoping he can bring consistency and power to the lineup. Additionally, his experience and track record in the league provide added security, especially in high-pressure moments like the final stretch of the regular season. Over his eight seasons in MLB, Smith has donned the colors of three different teams and participated in 683 games, a trajectory that demonstrates his resilience and adaptability at the highest level of baseball. Among the teams he has played for, the New York Mets stand out, where Smith had his best season in 2020 during the campaign shortened by the COVID-19 pandemic. That year, Smith not only established himself as one of the Mets' best players but also gained recognition throughout the league, receiving MVP votes. With an impressive OPS, on-base plus slugging, of .993 in just 50 games, he showed his ability to significantly impact the game on both sides of the field. Smith's signing also highlights the Reds' strategy of seeking players who can contribute immediately and fill gaps in the roster, especially in a season where injuries have been a constant concern. Smith's flexibility in playing both first base and other infield positions, along with his consistent performance at the plate, makes him a key piece for the remainder of the season. The Reds' coaching staff is confident that Smith can not only fill the void left by injured players but also contribute significantly to the team's playoff aspirations. In a division that has proven to be extremely competitive, every game counts, and the addition of a player of Smith's caliber might be just what the Reds need to take that extra step towards the postseason. Furthermore, Smith brings with him a winning mentality and experience in high-pressure games, which could be an important differentiator for a team looking to return to the spotlight and make a significant playoff run. The veteran first baseman has already demonstrated on several occasions his ability to deliver in crucial moments, and this is something that will certainly not go unnoticed by Reds fans. With Smith now on the roster, the Cincinnati Reds continue their pursuit of a playoff spot, and the expectation is that he will become a key player in the coming weeks. His performance with the Mets in 2020, where he had one of the best seasons of his career, is still remembered by baseball fans, and the Reds hope that he can replicate that success in Cincinnati. Hello, super subscribers. Thank you for the incredible support for our channel. Today, I'm asking for your help with donations to further improve our content. Your contribution will help us continue bringing quality and frequent videos. Any amount makes a difference. If you can help, click the donation link in the description. We have special rewards for donors. Thank you for all the support and see you in the next video. The Red Sox's decision to release Smith was met with some criticism from Boston's fanbase, especially given that Smith still has a lot to offer, both defensively and offensively. However, the return of Tristan Casas and the need to adjust the roster for the remainder of the season led to the decision to part ways with the veteran. Hello, super subscribers. Thank you for the incredible support for our channel. Today, I'm asking for your help with donations to further improve our content. Your contribution will help us continue bringing quality and frequent videos. Any amount makes a difference. If you can help, click the donation link in the description. We have special rewards for donors. Thank you for all the support and see you in the next video. Now in Cincinnati, Smith has the opportunity to revitalize his career and prove that he can still be a dominant force in the league. The Reds, on the other hand, gain a versatile and experienced player who can help solidify the defense and provide power at the plate. 
With the season entering its decisive phase, Smith's addition might be exactly what the Reds need to boost their run towards the playoffs and potentially, a deep postseason run. Time will tell how Dominic Smith will adapt to the new environment in Cincinnati, but one thing is certain, both the player and the team have high expectations for the future. If he can recapture the form he showed in 2020, the Reds will have made one of the best moves of the season. Meanwhile, fans in Cincinnati can look forward to seeing how this new addition to the roster will impact the team's performance in the weeks and months to come. Red Sox fan, what did you think of the sale of Dominic Smith? Leave your opinion in the comments and leave your like and share and subscribe to the channel and activate the notification to receive the latest news from Boston Red Sox. Help us reach the 2000 subscribers so that our channel arrives for more people I count on all of you.